How's it hanging, Jack Tackers, and welcome back to another video for you guys. Today, I'm going to be discussing some of the plot leaks for Spider-Man Homecoming 2. Or should I say, Spider-Man Field Trip. So, I'm going to read this article off from MovieWeb.com. Now, if you guys don't want to know anything about Spider-Man Homecoming 2... Uh, then click off the video, but if you are in for these potential spoilers, stay tuned. So the article says, Obviously, Peter Parker is back from wherever he went in Avengers Infinity War and survives the events of Avengers 4. However, according to this new leak, Parker is mourning the death of Tony Stark as the movie begins, which is the opposite of how we last saw the two together. Tony Stark has been rumored to not make it to Phase 4 of the MCU for over a year now, so this aspect seems legit. Elsewhere, the leak claims that Michael Keaton is back as Adrian Toomes, aka the Vulture, along with Mac Gargan, aka Scorpion, for small roles in Spider-Man Homecoming 2. Mysterio will reportedly be the main villain, which has also been reported, but there's no mention of Jake Gyllenhaal taking on the role. The leaks claim that the Spider-Man Homecoming 2 story will center on something groundbreaking that Tony Stark has created and Mysterio will steal it after being hired by a familiar villain. The new leak details does not specify who the mysterious boss is, but it says he's a major villain from the comic books who will have a prominent role in these movies moving forward. Sony and Marvel are reportedly looking for an A-list actor to take on the role, which is supposed to be a surprise. Again, nothing about this leak has been confirmed by Marvel or Sony, and even if it was, they would probably not even acknowledge it. Finally, the new Spider-Man Homecoming 2 leak also claims that the sequel will set up the Sinister Six. The leak says that it is confirmed, but that could mean anything. As far as seeing the Sinister Six in Spider-Man Homecoming 2, it's believed that they will be planting the seed in the film, instead of showing up right away. The leak goes on to imply that villains might not all show up in the third movie of the final either. They're expected to show up at some point down the line in Sony's Marvel Universe. You can read more about the Spider-Man Homecoming 2 leak over Reddit. So that's the leak right there. Um, it gives some decent information about Tony Stark's death and Mysterio and setting up the Sinister Six. And it looks like we're going to have an awesome rogues gallery that is going to be set up. See, I'm definitely excited to see uh, if the leaks are true, more Vulture and Scorpion. I think that'd be really dope because I think since they have set up Scorpion at the end in the post credit scene of Spider-Man Homecoming, it would be a great addition to see him on screen since we've never actually gotten a live action Scorpion. And like I said, I'd love to see the Sinister Six sometime. But anyway, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Are you interested even more so now with Spider-Man Field Trip? And if you are, let me know. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Boop.